Today I wanted to try out a project using Selenium. A nice simple one that came to mind was creating an I'm feeling lucky tool for YouTube videos. If you don't know what I'm feeling lucky is, it's just a feature that you can use with Google search. When you click I'm feeling lucky, it opens the first result from the search page and takes you there rather than showing you the full list of results. Here's a demonstration. Let's do a search for Selenium. See, straight to the first web page. It looks like it's about a dietary supplement or something, not the browser automation tool. Yeah, we can see the top search result was medical news today. That's the one that I'm feeling lucky opened. So we're gonna be making the same thing, but for YouTube search. The user's going to open up terminal and type in the search query, let's say cat videos. Then the program will go to youtube.com, search for cat videos. Then it'll click on the first video that comes up and play it for the user. I'm gonna be doing this in the Visual Studio Code IDE using Python. I'm just gonna open up a folder I've already created and then create a new file for the code. YouTubefeelinglucky.py This is an I'm feeling lucky search from Terminal for YouTube. The usage is type the name of the file, then the YouTube search term. So if we're taking arguments from the terminal, we're going to need sys.argv, and for using a web browser, we're going to need selenium. So we'll import sys, and from selenium, import web driver. First, I'm gonna declare the path of Chrome driver, we're going to need this for web driver. Then I'm going to create a list of the argv arguments. I go from 1 to the end of the list because the 0th argv argument is the name of the Python script and we don't want to search YouTube for that. Then we open a browser and go to youtube.com. looks like after we search something. Oh yeah, this is nice. So rather than using Selenium to go to the YouTube homepage, then pasting the search term into the search bar, we can go straight to the URL of our search term. YouTube.com slash results question mark search query equals then we just append our search term with plus signs between the words. Let's run it and see if it's working so far. didn't put in a search term. Python 3 YouTube feeling lucky dot pi and we're searching for cat videos. It worked! It searched for cat videos. Now we just need to tell it to click the first video. To do this I'm going to right click in the browser and inspect the element that we want to click on. Now, I need to find the HTML code that's for the thumbnail. There it is. It has the ID value thumbnail. <laughs> Makes sense. So we can use the find element by ID method to find the thumbnail element that we're going to click on. Then we just click on that element. 
thumbnail element dot click. Okay, I think we're done. Time to try it out. We'll stick with the search for cat videos. It works. I swear to God, I swear to God, you stupid. I'll run it from terminal just to make sure it's working. This time we'll search for Owen Wilson saying wow, some of YouTube's best. Look at that, it's working flawlessly. There he goes, pole vault over the thing, there he goes, and there he is. Oh. In terms of future improvements, I think it probably shouldn't click on ads. I'm pretty sure that cat video was an ad. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you liked the video, leave a like. If you want to see more from me, then consider subscribing. I'll see you in the next one. Let's go shoe shine. Wow, flippers and all, wow. 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 This is a nice boat. I swear I got screwed on the old bedroom selection. Every room's like four times as big as mine.